Here are your top three news of the day. Latifa Koya has resigned from her position as MACC Chief Commissioner yesterday after a government change last Sunday. The lawyer, however, has denied allegations that she was pressured to resign. In a press statement, Latifa says she will return to her former job as a human rights advocate lawyer. Uda Holdings Berhad Chairman Hisham Hamdan, the country's 26th coronavirus patient who has cases linked to him, has denied speculations that he was the source of infection. It was reported by media outlets that a former minister and a deputy min- minister attended a ceremony at a local hotel where the chairman was also present. Hisham is currently receiving treatment at a government hospital. Proceeding with a vote of no confidence against newly appointed Prime Minister Muhyiddin Yassin is similar to showing distrust of the young Dipetuan Agong Said Abdul Hadi Awang. The past president added that the king was wise in appointing Muhyiddin Yassin as the country's eighth Prime Minister. Muhyiddin was sworn in as Prime Minister on March 1st after plotting against the Pakatan Harapan government by joining forces with AMNO, PAS and ex-PKR Deputy President Muhammad Azmin Ali to form a new coalition. That's all for today, your three stories, two minutes.